Hello YouTube and welcome to lesson 13 of the Adobe InDesign tutorial series. So what we're going to do today is we're going to create uh, something like a brochure. So for that what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into file and go to document right here. Let's say I want to create something like a threefold brochure. So for that I can do a width as 30 and height as 66 pikers and just press OK just like here. So I got this single file just like that as you can see over here. And now what you can do is now uh, you can actually create a new page right here. So I'm going to create a new page right here and a new page right there, just like that. So, but the problem of this page, as you can see, is that uh, the top page over here uh, stays on the top, but the bottom ones over here are actually separated. Let's say I want three of the pages all together. And if you were to drag this in, you cannot see that you cannot drag anything at all. So I need to change that, that, that out. So I can go to the option over here and you have something called allow document space to shuffle. So uncheck that. So I just unchecked allow document pages to shuffle. And now you can see that if I were to drag this in, it actually goes along with that page at the top. And you can drag this in over here in the left and you can see that I got a three page brochure just like this. So I can actually create new pages just like this. As you can see, so I got three pages. I can simply uh, drag it out at the top. Let me just drag this in over here and then drag this one out over here on to the left side and over here. And you can see that I got three pages over here. So three pages over here and three pages over here, just like this. I can e even create four or five pages of the documents. So just click and drag and you can see that all of them actually uh, come together. So you can actually click and drag and just uh, arrange this out. And you can see that I can keep four, three or four or more documents all together and create a folding brochure just like this. As we learned in the previous lesson as well, what we can also do now is we can go to the page size, select individual pages. I can select any pages that I want and then change the width and height of that particular page as you can see. So I can individually control the size of the pages and <clears throat> everything else. So you can easily see how uh, InDesign is a great tool to design foldable brochures and creative brochures and this gives you easy control uh, rather than uh, in Photoshop or um, uh, Illustrator. So hope you guys learned something as always and as always please like, comment, share and subscribe.